Hi, in today's video, well, I'm, I'm going to be showing you how you can stream to Facebook Live using your smartphone if you have a church or any other, other organization to stream with your smartphone. This will work with iPhone or Android, like so. Now what you want to do is make sure you have all the equipment you need, like so. I'm going to be telling you the equipment you need, like so. And the first thing you want to do is make sure you have a good tripod and a good mount like so This is the phone mount. I made this. I have this little adapter right here where you can connect the microphone on top of it But I don't have the mount where the microphone will connect on the top like so Now what you want is you have an iPhone or an Android smartphone like so now what I'm gonna now the equipment or cables you're gonna need is this one, you want to have this cable, which is, which is, is it's a TRRS cable, which you can connect to your headphone jack, if your high, if your phone has one like so. Make sure it's a TRRS like that. Make sure it's not one like this. Make sure it's not a cable that has this type of plug in it, like so. You see? It's, these two plugs are different. One has three rings and the other one has two rings. Like so. Make sure it has three for it to work like this. Like so. You should have headphones. You have headphones you want to use that have the three ring. Go ahead and use it because this one has a microphone which you can use as a lapel mic. Like so. Now the other cable you're going to need is this one. This is to connect an iPhone. An iPhone to it, like so. This will convert the head, the lightning cable jack into a headphone adapter, which this can work the same way, like so. Connect this into it, into an iPhone, with this cable, will work the same way. Don't worry, if you have a bunch of adapters dangling, like so. Like this, if you have a bunch of adapters dangling, like your microphone connected like so right here and a bunch of adapters like so do not worry about that this is okay the audio will still come in like so now what you want to do is you want to have this microphone right so you want to have this microphone or any other other boom microphone like so I will be showing you two steps to connect an audio recorder like so or I'm gonna be showing you how to connect this microphone right there this boom microphone to your phone like so with this audio recorder like so this audio recorder is gonna get connected connected to the phone like so now now once we once we've gotten over the equipment you're going to need, the first thing you want to do is connect your iPhone, like so. You want to turn on your iPhone, like so. And make sure the orientation is not locked on your iPhone, like so. iPhone or Android, like so. Make sure the orientation is not locked on your Android or iPhone, like so. By clicking this rotate button, like so. Make sure if you're going to be streaming on your iOS or Android device that you have either mobile data which is unlimited or Wi-Fi. So you don't have bad quality uh, quality pixelated iPhone streams or Android streams. Make sure you have Wi-Fi or mobile data. Now what you want to do is head over to your Facebook like so. Now, what you want to be doing is make sure you rotate your phone like so in the mount. You want to always have your iPhone or Android in port in landscape mode, not in portrait mode. Like so. Now, now once you're here, what you're going to be seeing is that there is a live button. But before we click live on that, you want to connect your cables to your to your to your phone like so. If you have an iPhone. What you want to do is you can buy an adapter 
that that charges your iPhone and connects the same adapter like this to it. But since I have an Android phone with a headphone jack, I can still charge my phone normally. Now, what I'm going to be showing you is how to connect all this up. You want to grab your microphone like so. Grab your microphone like this microphone like so. I wouldn't, I'm just going to be holding the microphone because I don't have an adapter that, that will mount it to the bracket up here. Now, now what you want to do is connect this adapter or the lightning to iPhone adapter. Like so. Now like this. Connect this other end. Like so. Into this end right here. Like so. It, it will be a bit snug when you try to connect it. Like so. You see? It's a bit snug. If you don't hear the click on your adapter, that means the adapter might be broken. Now, what you want to do is click live like so. You want to click live and then the audio you're going to be hearing will come will be coming from this microphone like so. Now, what you want to do is you don't want it to be public. You can just put private or public to anyone. I'm going to put private. Like so, by clicking more, and then only me, right there for now, and then click back, like so. Now, what I'm going to be showing you is that the, is press this button right there to go live. And then the audio you're going to be hearing will be coming from this, from this microphone, like so. Now, now you should be hearing the audio coming from this microphone like so. I don't know how good the microphone audio is going to be sounding like so. Testing, testing. This is the second test I'm doing of this Rode microphone. I don't know if you can hear it like so. If you, if you can hear it in the comments section of this video, Say I hear it. If you don't hear it, say I don't hear it. Like so. Now what you can do is if you want to do it, you can go with your live video. Like so. Like that. This is the simplest way to live stream on your iPhone or Android. Now what you want to do is click finish. Like so. You can either you can either publish it, delete it, or save it. But what I'm gonna do is not even save it or delete it. I'm just gonna be saving it to my gallery like so. There it says save to gallery like that. Now what you wanna do is I'm gonna be showing you how to connect that little audio recorder to your to your smartphone like so what you want to do is grab your audio recorder like so you want to grab your audio recorder like so this audio recorder like so you want to grab it like so and then on the side of it you should see that there's a line in and headphone headphone jack adapter right there you should see the line in and headphone Headphone, what you want to do is grab this adapter, which is an aux cable, like so. This is an aux cable. Connect this end into this. Make sure you have a high quality aux cable, like so. Like so. And then the other end, you want to connect it to your adapter as TRRS. Make sure you don't have a, a TRS adapter, like this. Because that will not work. Now, what you want to do is grab your adapter like so and connect it in. You heard that click, so that means it's clicked in. Now, if you record with your built in camera, you should be this adapt, there should be this little menu right here. There should be this little menu that pops up right now, like so. 
it says right there recording audio through your headphone your headphone it says recording audio with headset right there now the test that I'm gonna be showing you will be coming from Facebook like so now you want to do the same steps to go to Facebook and do a live stream Now I'm going to be redoing the live stream by clicking live like so. Right there and then. And then you can do that but if you have a Facebook group. If you have a group or a Facebook page you can click right here. Nest tech I'm going to do that my Facebook page and then you could do you could do right here. You could do a Facebook live in here too. You can do a Facebook live but I'm not going to do it right here. Because you can put post and then that will give go live right here. Right there you can go live. You see right there it's the same way of going live. Now the audio you're going to be hearing it's com will be coming from this Facebook live video like so like so the audio you're going to be hearing will be coming from this from this Facebook live audio recorder like so you can click this button right so This is now I'm gonna be giving you the test. Test test. I don't know if you can hear this this audio coming from this recorder like so. I'm gonna be tapping the microphone to to tell you if you hear it the audio will be distorted like so. The audio should be distorted right now. If you hear the audio, click if you, if you hear the audio in the description or in the comment section click no if you hear the audio in the description of this video no I mean if you hear the audio in the f comment section of this video type in I hear the audio but if you do not hear it click I don't hear the audio I don't hear the audio like so now end the Facebook live like so Now, you can either share it or save it, which I'm going to be saving it, is that will save it to your gallery, like so. And then, on your audio recorder, you want to press the, the pause button right here. Right here, or if your audio recorder, you want to press this, this button right here, the record button. You want to press the record button before you start your live. Because if you do not press the record button, you will not be able to hear the audio coming from this XLR microphone, microphone handy recorder, like so. You want to connect your handy recorder by pressing record and the levels right here, right here, levels right here. You want to set your levels accordingly to what your audio is, like so. Then right here, volume. This is the volume coming out of the, the audio recorder into Facebook audio. But for me, I, I don't know if you can hear the audio because it was super low. Now, that's it for this video guys and how to live stream for your church on a budget like so. I hope this video helped you out if you want to live stream on a budget like so. This, this will also work for a YouTube video or a YouTube live stream like so. Thanks for watching. Bye.